We just walked in, and as you see when you walk in, it's all covered. And then you keep going, it's a nice sofa. This is where we've been eating all of our meals. The school actually provides all three meals a day in here. And then as you keep walking through all the buildings, you get to this point where you're back outside um, and it's just beautiful, full blush. It rained all night last night. So all of these plants got tons of water and then um, it stays completely dry though uh, in the inside areas. Okay, I'm upstairs now. So there's actually a whole nother upstairs that I'll show you in a little bit. That's where our kids are taking lessons. Um, so their Spanish teachers go up there with them. They all have their own little tables and uh, they get a huge uh, view and they can see the volcano from where they do instructions. Um, behind us, we've got some other uh, doors because there's a whole bunch of different rooms up this way. is uh, one way out to the balcony but I'll take you around this way so you can see what some of the rooms look like. Our whole family of five is staying in this one room. We could have had more, but we wanted to stay together, so we moved one of the beds from downstairs, upstairs, and we're all in this snug little room. Okay. We got Tyler. We got Lil E. We got our D-man. So our bathroom's over here. It's much older. Um, the water, you cannot drink the water or use it to brush your teeth here. So we have bottles of water that we use to pour on the toothbrushes. You come in. Okay, here it is. We are at the very top. And if you come check it out over here, you can actually see volcanoes from here. Um, some of the volcanoes are back here. So we spent just over $1,900 for our family of five to stay at the school. We were there um, all week and then did classes Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. We each had our own individual teacher who taught fast pace um, based upon the knowledge level that each person was at. It also included three meals a day and it did include transportation round trip to and from the airport. And then it also allowed us to have time on Saturday and Sunday to do some excursions like climbing volcanoes. What was your first impression of Antigua? Um, I was surprised that it wasn't super hot. Um, apparently in June it's winter here, which I was really surprised about.